Hey YouTube, Jim here. Welcome to Top 10 Archive. Man, memes are really the internet's way of getting back at all of us for not believing when others said, what you post on the internet is forever. Whatever pictures we post of our kids, of ourselves, of our dogs, can and will become bait for internet trolls. Whether they take an unflattering picture from our middle school yearbook or our pup smirking, one day your photo is just for you, and the next it's for the world to fill in the blank with their hilarious situation of choice. And that's what brings us to today's installment of the top 10 weirdest stories behind popular memes. But before we get started, why not become an archivist today by clicking that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any future uploads. If you end up enjoying this video, let us know by giving it a thumbs up and tell us what your favorite go-to meme is in the comment section. Number 10, the Ermagerd Girl. This hilarious meme depicts a young blonde girl in poofy pigtails looking a little too excited about Goosebumps books. The Ermagerd Girl is in pure ecstasy and is generally captioned with all sorts of exciting captions. The very excited girl wasn't notified until three years later when she was backpacking in India. Turns out, she turned all that excitement around into a nursing career in Arizona. If anything, this story makes the Ermagerd girl even more relatable. You can look like that, which we all did, let's face it, love books and still backpack the world and land a good job as an adult. Success! Number 9. First World Problems Lady Silvio Bottini is the face of the First World Problems meme. It's hard to say why a picture of a crying woman would become a meme like this. Perhaps it's the scarce tears with clear paths across the flawless face. I mean, come on, we all cry uglier than that. Maybe someone saw this and thought, she's got to be crying about getting soy instead of almond milk in her coffee. What's weird though is that they could be right. Silvia Bottini is far from regular like most other memes. She's a model and actress. She starred in commercials and teaches her own public speaking course. So they basically nailed it with this one. Nicely done, internet. Number 8. The Stop Girl If you haven't seen The Stop Girl, it's a meme of a young woman, hand on her forehead, smiling shyly, asking the cameraman at an Iowa-Arizona college football game to stop filming her. The request and the image itself led to a bunch of random falling for her, of course. Her name is Sarah, and she was watching the game with deep concentration, agonizing when her team wasn't doing so well. A camera was fixed on her throughout her ups and downs, and then she got fed up and asked them to stop, smiling. Now she just hopes the internet gets over her at some point. Number 7. Skateboarding Professor Skateboarding Professor is one of the coolest memes out there. It pictures a, let's say, older professor, briefcase in hand, skateboarding around campus. He's wearing a tie and everything. He also looks like he's having the time of his life. Students behind him aren't even batting an eye. It looks like regular life for them. Of course, the internet took this image and made him the coolest professor around. My favorite caption? Got his BA in being a BA. The skateboarding professor has a name, of course. He's 68-year-old Tom Winter from the University of Nebraska. He says he's 19 on the inside, but his 68-year-old joints have a hard time with the treks to and from class. So, of course, both his inner college student and his outer old man appreciate the skate. Number 6. Nola Oaks Speaking of old people at universities, Nola Oaks became a similar meme to the skateboarding professor. However, while the professor is the cool guy, Nola is teased as being the person who is too old for the room. Some memes include, assigned as your lab partner, dies, and here's fact, argues. But my favorite is, corrects history professor, remembers being there. And these memes aren't far off. Born in 1911, Nola Oaks graduated university at the age of 96 and became the oldest college grad ever. So, even though they poke fun at her, she's actually the real badass. Skateboarding around campus? Eh. Try living to 105 years old. Nola is the real champ. Number 5. Ikea Monkey The Ikea Monkey meme is one of those examples that shows us that anything can really be a meme. Ikea Monkey is often paired with other memes to tell a larger story. 
On its own, IKEA Monkey is just a macaque monkey wearing a coat at an IKEA store. Of course, once spotted, that picture blew up the internet like wildfire. My favorite mashup is the cat reading a newspaper slash IKEA monkey mix, where the cat meme says, I was supposed to pick up Carl, and the monkey looks sad and alone. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. The meme picked up so much speed, it was even turned into a game. The monkey had actually been roaming the store for a bit before animal control showed up and denied the return to its owners, despite a long legal battle. Turns out it's illegal to own a macaque in Toronto, no matter how many coats he wears. Number 4. Successful Black Man The successful black man meme features a photo of a man in a business suit on a brown color wheel. He's the face of the black stereotype turned success story in 10 words or less. Some highlights from this meme include, yo, hablo inglés y español. My girl has a huge assignment for her law class. And let's get high, grades on our finals. This meme is quite clever and actually quite accurate. Turns out, successful black man is actually a successful black man who happens to be the face of a stock photo. He's an electrical engineer from Texas who works at General Electric. He's even competed in bodybuilding, the full package. Number 3. Ridiculously Photogenic Guy This, just like the last, is quite self-explanatory. The Photoshop meme features a smiling man running some sort of race. Reddit found the photo, as it usually does, and realized the man was way too good looking while running an actual race. It becomes the face of being so photogenic that everyone hates you. Kind of like the Ryan Gosling, hey girl meme. Among my favorites are smiles at the camera, girl who took the picture is now pregnant, and runs marathon and wins my heart. Another one of my favorites is see a couple of girls taking a disastrous photo turns it into a work of art. The photo is of Zeddy Little, a runner in the Cooper River Bridge Run in Charleston, South Carolina. One of the photographer's friends, seeing the photos on his Flickr, referred to him as a ridiculously photogenic guy, and the photo later made its way to Reddit. Zeddy Little was shocked but amused at his fame, as I admit, I would be too if I were pretty much called way too handsome in photos. <laughs> Number 2. Not Impressed Michaela Maroney receiving her silver medal at the Olympics is one of the most famous memes out there. In the image, she's holding flowers in her crossed arms, wearing her silver medal which she holds in the fingers of her right hand, absent-mindedly. On her face, a look of pure boredom. Unimpressed Michaela, as she became known for after the incident, has been used for messages about customer service, disappointment, and even the reaction to Fifty Shades of Grey. After, she explained she was just thinking of how she could have done much better. She's laughed it off and even reenacted the face with former President Barack Obama. Number 1. Plastic Surgery Ad Fail This meme started as more fake news than anything else. The headline? Man sues his wife for bearing unattractive children. The story featured a man named Jim Feng, who was appalled at the appearance of his and his wife's children. According to the story, he thought she cheated on him. Then, she allegedly admitted she paid hundreds of thousands of dollars in plastic surgery, and he divorced and sued her. This was all far from the truth. In fact, Heidi Ye, a Taiwanese model, had posed for the photo thinking it run as a cosmetics ad. Instead, it ran as an ad for plastic surgery reading, the only thing you'll ever have to worry about is how to tell the kids. Now there's a very real lawsuit at hand as Ye tries to sue the posters for defamation. Hmm, does anyone feel deja vu of when Joey Tribbiani modeled for a VD ad? Hmm? Thanks for watching. What's your favorite meme of all time? Let us know in the comments section below. Before you go, be sure to subscribe to the channel, click the notifications bell, give this video a thumbs up, and share it with others.